Hey everybody, Roy Diamonds Too Loyal back again with another Life Lessons with Lewis video. Wife super glues wrinkles on face to look younger. What the heck? This is the most dumbest thing I've ever heard. But do y'all remember that one girl that went viral for super gluing her hair? I think she, yeah, I think she used like monkey glue or something. Or gorilla glue to like lay down her hair because she was out of hair products. And that was the dumbest thing that anybody could have ever done. And she regretted it because that took a lot. Like She had to get people like doctors and stuff to help. But anyways, guys, let's get into this video. I just want to say, what in the world made her think that this is going to make you look younger? Like, why would glue make you look younger? <sighs> She's stressing, man. I'm ready. Whoa, whoa, whoa. This is what you're wearing to the party? What's wrong with it? Oh, her husband don't appreciate how the way how she looking. Does it make me look fat or something? It make her look old. It's I... not the dress that makes you look fat. Oh, he said make you look what fat. What are you giving me that look for? You know you put on a bunch of weight. Babe, you know it's been tough for but me. But you don't say that to your wife. Come on now, lowering her self-esteem. Since the baby was born. No, I don't know that. What I do know, the gym memberships will not work if you don't use it. You know how embarrassing it is to have a wife with stretch marks? Hey, wow. it takes time. The doctor said a minimum of six months to a year before I can get back to working out again. There's a nurse Come on now, like, you know she just had a baby. Why you, why you acting like that? Process. Oh, what does the doctor know? Well... He's a doctor. Then why don't you date him then? Maybe she will. The sweatpants? Really? I'm sorry, babe. This was the only thing I could fit in. Ah, oh, forget it. Let's just go. I'll have to hide you in the back somewhere. Wow. He said, I'll have to hide you in the back somewhere. Man, that's, I, I'll be like, I don't want to go no more. He could leave and I'll pack my stuff and be out on him. So what's the deal with your wife over there, sitting all alone? <laughs> Man, she's got a bad attitude. Let her sit over there by herself. She got a bad attitude. You guys attitude. getting a fight or something? She hasn't been able to lose all the extra weight since having the baby. What? It's disgusting. Hey, you cannot oh. talk about your wife like that, all right? That's not healthy. Yeah, let him it's know. It's not healthy let for him her know. to have all this extra weight, neither. I mean, how does she expect me to sleep next to her every single night when there are beautiful young girls like this? Hey. She could easily have said that she don't want to be with you because you're getting gray hair and you're starting to, you look, you looking older faster. She could have said that about you. Boys, would you like some champagne? Don't mind if we do. What's your name, young lady? I'm Sarah. I'm new here. Hi, I'm Darren. This is my coworker, Mike. Hey, Sarah. Nice to meet you. Um, I'm gonna go hang out with some of the other guests. I don't think he feel comfortable being around him because of how he treating his wife and how he talk about his wife like that. You new here? How old does that make you? I'm 20. 20. That's a funny age. Is it? I can't even drink yet. You can legally vote. <laughs> like, that's so much fun. So, what do you do here? Hey. He's leaving his wife Victoria, all Victoria, right? Yeah. What's up? Um, my name is Mike. I'm a Darren's friend. I just saw you sitting by yourself. Did I give you some company? Thanks. Uh... Uh, I'm the CEO, uh, one of the founding members. So you're the one that writes my paychecks, huh? I'm the one that determines who gets a raise 
and who gets let go. A man in power. I like that. So how Look at old him. are abusing. you, Mr. Abusing. Darren, CEO, sir? Guess. 34? 40. Wow. You're my dad's age. Intimidated? Should I be? Just checking. He's old enough to be your dad, girl. Mm -mm. She wants sugar daddy. Look how she, look how- By the way, congrats on having that baby. That's awesome. That's so cool. Like, I, I've always wanted kids. Just never really, you know, worked out or anything like that. The timing's always been Dude, she see her husband flirting with another woman and she not about to go do nothing about it, bruh? Like, she just sitting there seeing this and she not about to go do nothing? Off, but having a child, it's like a gift from God. You know what I mean? Having a daughter, it's a cool experience to you go walk away have from that in <laughs> your, your life. Or, uh, she didn't hear a word I said. All right. Seven five five five. Got it. Hey, honey, who's your new friend? Oh, hey, you. Um, look, Victoria. This he hit her with the oh, hey, you. Oh man, he ain't want to say that he with her. To Sarah, Sarah, this is Victoria. Yes, why? Oh, I didn't know you were married. Yep. Yeah, she said it. she spoke up. She was like his wife because he wasn't about to be like my wife. He was not about to say that. Years happily married. Wow, that's amazing. Well, looks like I'm out of champagne. Better go get some more. You should go do that. What? Look how she put that. Come on. Let's that go. young girl dang near still gonna mess around with him knowing he married. Come on now. Young girls be doing that. Oh, you're always so negative at these parties. How is she being negative? She was introducing herself two weeks later. Darren, think about what you're doing. We are a family. We have a daughter for crying out loud. I didn't ask for this. I didn't want to get married. You, di you didn't want to get married, but you married her? So did you marry her just because she was pregnant or something? Why'd you marry her? And you, and you got her pregnant, so now it's like, you gonna let all that happen just to walk out on her? You stole my 20s away from me. And I want to live my life as what? a single man. What about our daughter, Isabella? You want her- He blaming that on her? And when you, you guys both played a part in it. You guys made that child together. You guys got married together. To grow up without a father? I grew up without a father. Look at me. I turned out just- You're hard. horrible. No, you're Go horrible. Go ahead and file with the court. I'll send you a check every month. But I'm not staying with a woman that has wrinkles all over her face what the heck? and stretch marks all over her body. That's normal, dude. <laughs> what the heck? Yeah. <laughs> Seems like he want to stay with girls that are way younger than him. They got to be 20 years old for him to be wanting them. Victoria could not believe it. Her husband of 11 years was leaving her for not looking like she did when she was 21 years old. She was absolutely devastated. She had gone through a decade of verbal abuse from her husband that she no longer knew who she was anymore. He constantly belittled her and put her down so much so that Victoria went to extremes to do anything to try and look younger, including one night where she lost her mind and even tried putting glue on her forehead just to try and get the wrinkles wow. to go away. After months and months of crying and feeling sorry for herself, Victoria decided to pick herself back up and make a change in her life. She was determined to get back. Yeah, you know, you know, work out, work out and, and do some self love, learn how to love yourself. So that way, anybody else come at you like that, you know how to handle it. Version of herself, not because some man is telling her, but because she wanted to do that for herself. Meanwhile, Darren's life began to crumble and go downhill. His love affair he had with Sarah slowly disappeared when she found out that he wasn't the CEO of the company. Dang. He spends up every last dime he had trying Dang. to hold on to her until there was nothing left. His life spiraled downhill from there. He was taking all his money. That's what you get for leaving a good woman for a, a, a gold digger. Two years later.
Do you have any spare change? Oh, sorry, I... Darren, is that you? Victoria? What are you doing uh, here? I live here. What are you doing here? Um, well, I lost something just looking... In the trash can? Uh, he homeless. You look amazing. Did you have a plastic surgery or something? It's called working out. <laughs> Maybe you should try Whoa, it sometime. Whoa, his friend got with it. Mike, is that you? Yeah, it's me. What are you doing down here? Well, we're together now. You guys are dating now? Not anymore. We're engaged. <gasps> Mike, what the? Nah. You broke guy code. You broke husband code way back when, all right? I warned you about the way you treat. He didn't like he didn't like him after that. Once he found out how he treated his woman, he didn't like him after that. Treated her, okay? You always made her feel horrible, and it was all because you were so insecure. You didn't know what you had. You can't treat a wife like that. You can't treat a marriage like that. That's not how marriage works. You ready to go? Yeah, I'm ready. Wait, Victoria, can I have a moment? Sorry, Darren. It doesn't work like that. You can't treat her the way you did and come crawling back. Babe, actually, I want a moment with him. Can you wait in the car? Sure. You got a minute. What's the problem with him? His problem? <laughs> you know, I've always wondered what I would say to you if I saw you again, and now that I'm here, nothing. Nothing comes to mind. I just don't care enough. His problem is- I wanna see his daughter, cause I wanna see how he gonna act. Like they should have put the daughter in his, what a daughter at? my problem that there are humans like you who take complete advantage over a person and belittle them for years without any consequence now i don't blame you for everything no 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 i won't let you have that power over me it is my fault that i stay with a scumbag like you in a weird way i <laughs> guess i should thank you Thank you for showing me what darkness looks like. I now understand what it is what I have with Mike is special. He showed me light. He showed me what a healthy relationship feels like. Good luck, Darren. I wish you find what you're looking for. Yeah. Maybe it's underneath the bottom of that trash can. <laughs> That don't feel good, do it. Again, I hope. Man, this one was a good one. Thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned. I'll be back with more videos and I'm out.